really want to thank you for your uh, tremendous commitment and uh, your diligence as chair of the subcommittee on African Affairs. You've really been terrific. Senator Shaheen. I want to thank you again for the attention that you bring to this issue and certainly the reality that we see. We witness hundreds of people running to the hills to hide in caves for their safety, and that happens every day. These people are not the cave people of Nuba. They actually live in farms, and they have the, the oldest society in the, in the world, and yet now they're forced to hide in caves. It is a campaign of murder and fear and displacement and starvation, and that is also a fact. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank you Senator Shaheen. Um, a couple quick questions, and I think we'll close out. But, uh, Jonathan, what... Uh we need to do what we're best at, real diplomacy, starting with China. China has a $20 billion investment in oil infrastructure in the Sudan, and right now they're getting nothing for it. We need to use this opportunity to work in tandem with the Chinese to solve these cross-border issues, not by using guilt, not by appealing to humanitarian interests, but simply for good, solid economic reasons for both of us. Let's send a high-level envoy to China to work together on this. Senator Mendez. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, I want to thank all of you for your insights. And uh, where you... These people, every single day of their lives, have to deal with fear, uh, not just of the future in terms of starving to death, but actually actively being killed. And that, is, that was what the majority of what we're here to do. You know, we're, uh, I'm here to talk about the dangers of these people particularly. And the specifics are that the, the exact same people who did this in Darfur are the, are the people that are doing this again. And the signs, as the ambassador said, are ominously similar. Hague, for a second. I, 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 I do want to say one thing. Uh, Administrator, uh, but we thank you all for coming. Uh, we keep the record open until uh, one week on the close of business, Wednesday, March 21st. We stand adjourned.